News at 6. Albemarle County Police are investigating a case of neglect at a home daycare operation. The detectives say they discovered more than a dozen infants and young children with only one woman caring for them. And now Kathy Rahm is facing a felony charge with more charges possibly on the way. NBC 29's Henry Graff is live on scene for us tonight in Albemarle County. Good evening, Henry. Steve, good evening. Albemarle County Police and Child Protective Services raided this house here behind me in the Forest Lake subdivision after receiving a tip about potential child neglect. I did speak with parents involved in this case off camera. They tell me they are surprised and they are angry. Police arrested 53-year-old Kathy Rahm Wednesday afternoon. She's charged with felony cruelty and injuries to children. Police say Rom was running a daycare operation in her house on Turnberry Circle. They aren't sure if she's licensed. Investigators found 16 children inside the home. They range from just a few months old to four years old. Police say some children had diapers that clearly needed to be changed. Rom was denied bond this afternoon in juvenile and domestic relations court. So this was a bond hearing on Thursday for the court to initially look at bond, but because uh, the defendant was already on a bond, the court decided that um, the presumption that required the court to hold someone with bond would not be overcome, and so bond was denied. In that hearing, we also learned that Rahm is already facing a felony assault charge on an EMT from a previous incident. At this point, detectives say the children don't appear to have any physical injuries. Police also tell me when I spoke with them today, more charges are pending. A preliminary hearing is now set in this case for January 8th. Authorities say the daycare operation here behind me has been happening for some time now. They aren't exactly sure, but they do want to hear from anybody who might have had their children here in the past. They're looking for you to call police with that information. Henry Graff live for us tonight. Thank you, Henry.